just wrapped in some nice fabric just to make it look good. But you will notice at the end here of the copper strands we have an alloy. You all can see that alloy there. Now what I'm going to do, and I'm going to do it in this area here just because uh, there's not enough space where you're all standing. You don't have to move into the sun just yet unless you want to. Mm. Oh yes, yes, this works. Uh, this absolutely works. I'm going to show you how predictable this machine is. Now, I was actually in uh, Bacchus Marsh a few days ago, and uh, it took about 40 seconds. But no, sorry, it took exactly 40 seconds for the uh, electric charge to travel through this, and I felt like that was a little bit too long. So what I have done is I have cut. The wire in half, ladies and gentlemen, which tells me that it should take 20 seconds exactly for this to explode. Right? Anyway, I've gone a little off track. I'm going to uh, step up my So, pretending this is our giant hole in the wall here, I'm going to put exactly two scoops and no more. Actually, hang on. Let me just put my electric wire. I forgot to put that in. That's probably quite important, isn't it? Now, I might just grab this in there while I'm over here. Sorry, I can't see this bit. Now, like I said, no more than two scoops, ladies and gentlemen. Three scoops, and well, it would be very bad. <laughs> very, very bad indeed. So, two scoops, no more, no less. Now, the important part is that we don't break the copper strands whilst I'm putting in this cork. Mm. We have to make sure that our alloy, which was that little bit of wire, is completely submerged. Now we're going to create a little compression. It's going to be quite a nice explosion, I think. Mm. And then we put the safety cap on. Now, this is now a live explosion, folks. Mm -hmm. Or a nice live explosive, I should say. We'll place this here, like that. without using your fingers or your toes? I can make it to 15. <laughs> really? You can't make it to 20, are you sure? Well, okay, it's not. I'm gonna Sorry. take your word for it, Sarah. I think you can. But you must, um, you must count scientifically. So that means like one banana, two banana, like that. Okay. And if you're feeling really adventurous, I like to put a little dance movie and I just go one banana, two banana, three banana. Can you do that, sir? Can I come closer? Uh, I wouldn't if I were you. <laughs> Alright, I'm going to assume right, yes. Okay. Alright, so he's going to do that. Uh, I'm going to count to three. I'm going to throw the switch. This is going to take 20 seconds, no more, no less. That's going to explode. And uh, and then uh, that'll be it. Mm -hmm. Alright. So, are you ready? Yeah. In three, in two, in one more thing, ladies and gentlemen. No. Uh, before I say that, um, I also did want to say that I am here just to save lives. Now, you, sir, you look like someone who doesn't care much about, you know, their clothing or uh, fancy things in life. Is that right? <laughs> yes, that's what I thought. Sir, can you tell me how much you would place on a human life? I, I, I mean, let me help you here. Would you not say that it is just simply priceless? Priceless. Priceless. Yes, that's right. So, it would be fair for me to then... Oh, say this could be worth, I mean, life-saving device, uh, eight pounds, right? Don't answer that, sir, because <laughs> I am not going to charge you eight pounds for this. I'm going to charge you six pounds. I should bring my boss, boss with me. You should, <laughs> yes. Sir, for today, you can have this life-saving device for a mere five pounds deposit. Come and visit me after the fire, and we should work out all the finer details. <laughs> now, um... Are we on now? Yeah, we're still doing oh, it. Okay. It's actually happening. I'm not just going to talk the whole time. I did promise to blow something out. All right, maybe just step back a little bit, folks. I did put a lot of powder in there. All right, blasting, taking place no? in three, in two, in one. Count bananas. One banana. 
Ladies and gentlemen, <laughs> it appears that the Voltaic battery now works. Yes, five times faster! Huzzah! Yes! So uh, because of that, I'm going to give it to you, Mom, for a mere four pounds instead. What do you say? Four pounds? Can you do three? No, definitely not. I'm the one scouting. Three and a half? Three and seven five? Yes! Oh, fantastic! Ladies and gentlemen, round of applause for my fantastic volunteer. Thank you, thank you, thank you. You're very welcome. <laughs> and for the man I insulted. <laughs> also very good. Uh, that's it, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you so much for watching. And uh, you, Mum, we shall meet at the bar later on. Oh. Six o'clock. Oh. I'm going to need to drink another bottle of whiskey, uh, I think. I'll be there. Oh, fantastic. Well, thank you so much, thank ladies you. and gentlemen. You. You've that's been a wonderful nice audience. Yeah. And, uh, yes, my work Can I borrow that one? What was that, sorry? Can I borrow it? No, this is the only one I've got. <laughs> oh, that's that's right. a legit one, though, right? No, this is not a legit like, one. Uh,